So in the middle of last year, we talked about getting a new studio to concentrate on newborns and family photography. Those talks spiraled and on November the 1st, we got keys to a new studio. However, it didn't look quite like a studio. It was an old office building from the 70s decorations. Um, so from that, there was an adventure ahead to turn it around into Wombat and Bear Family Photography. So let us take you in the studio to see it for the first time. Now bear in mind, this hasn't been renovated yet. So I'll see as you would do the honors. I do hope I can open it. <laughs> it feels like under a hammer. <laughs> so, compromises of two separate rooms. So this is the first one here, uh, a smaller room. Having this immediate area as like a kind of reception with Suze's desk and then this back bit here as like a storeroom for newborn props and stuff like that. Still don't know whether the door's gonna be here or whether the door's gonna come through that bit there, but these windows are all going, we don't want those. And then this is the main room, completely stains on the carpet and everything. But what's really good is the carpet literally just looks up. So that's going to be amazing because um, the whole place is going to be renovated. So there's going to be a wall across that bit there. This is where the main paper is going to hang down and all the newborn sets are going to be. Everything's going to be plastered. Everything's going to be uh, laminate floored. Everything's going to be laminate floored, plastered, everything. Uh, blinds for the windows. Still don't really know what we're doing that, do we? Ikea, Ikea Rollins Ikea. Ikea for everything, yeah. Um, this is our little window in the world. So we're in Longton, uh, just above Mad Hatter's. Uh, this is a door. Tanania. It's Tanania. That's what I'm going to tell the kids. It's Tanania or somewhere cool. Or PAL security systems who are next door. Um, but yeah, that doesn't actually, we're not actually going to do anything with that. I think we're going to maybe try and cover that up, depending on how expensive it is. But the key factor is it's going to be super cute, a little bit girly. It's my studio. Okay. It's a family studio. So it will be nice and cute and warm. I'm very excited. So now the countdown is on. We have 39 days to transform this into a fully working studio. We already have shoots booked in on the 9th of December and across that weekend. So this has to be ready by then. I'm sure we can do it. Day two in the studio. Did all right yesterday for the first day. A lot of wallpapers come off all the way underneath there. Skirtings are off almost, apart from that one annoying big plank that goes right the way through. I reckon today, Susie's gonna be in all day today, so I think today she's probably gonna end up getting the rest of this off. I would have thought that wallpaper off and there. Uh, ready for Phil the Builder. Hello. To come in at the weekend and start putting stub walls in and all the fun stuff. Uh, but yeah, 38 days to go. Let's have it. We have an update on the studio. We are now plastered on our walls, and this week is painting week. So here is a little oh, that's what here is a little look of what it currently looks like. So that will be the stock room, which is currently the junk room. This will be the 
off it. So it's just the ceiling needs to dry a little bit more. So then this is the main room. So the majority is now dry. So I can get started on that. And then it's just a case of flooring, artwork, laminates, brackets, so all the little bits after that. Um, but hopefully painting will be a big turnaround for it. We have 10 days to go until the studio opens. Suze is panicking a little bit, but there has been big improvements. So we now have fully plastered, fully painted, just a bit down there needs to dry, you can see, but fully painted walls, mainly by this lady here who has worked her backside off. Um, let me just shut this door. So this is going to be like the little office bit. Uh, so it's got the, the cream of the logo, uh, the blue of the logo. This is a horrific mess in there, which you really shouldn't see. But that's going to be like a um, prop room and stuff. We don't want you to see going in there. Uh, so it's going to be a door here. Uh, and we are here in the studio now waiting for the sofa, which shouldn't be here for another two days, but they've just surprised us and said, oh, it's hard for delivery. So we've quickly hot-tailed it to the studio to kind of wait for that. But Phil Hello. is coming tonight and he's going to help me. He's going to do most of the work, but help, help me uh, do the flooring. So the laminate is here, ready to go. Uh, you just saw us lug that up the stairs. I almost died. Um, and then yeah, the flooring should be done tonight. Then there's skirtings, architraves, doors. Then that's pretty much it. I just want my couch to arrive. <laughs> Finally, have the floor in. Or impossibly. <laughs> Hopefully, when we get home, there will be finals waiting for windows and doors. And then Phil, the almighty Phil, Hello. will come in and do door frame skirting, electric guys coming in, all the little bits that I keep stressing about but are getting done. Thank you so much to <laughs> Phil. Hello. And to Derek. Um, you might have seen on the on the um, video that we've done. I did a, a little bit, but I've done pretty much next to nothing for all this. Um, so thank you to Phil. Hello. And Derek. Just going back to do the skirting boards along the bottom there. That should be tomorrow. Oh, sorry, no, coming tomorrow. It's being delivered tomorrow. It's going it's done over the weekend. Over the weekend, yeah. And then. We've got another test shoot in tomorrow. We have baby Hugo. a little Hugo coming in. Um, and then, yeah, we've got artwork. So we've got a vinyl for this one, and then artwork for this one, and this one, and then another vinyl for this one. So the vinyls have come today. Hopefully they'll be at home uh, when we get home. And then we've also got a vinyl for the door, this part of the door is going to be on the other side. So yeah, we're getting there, but the flooring is a massive part. I think the skirting boards will, will make a massive, massive difference. It'll feel like a, a more finished room then. And then we need blinds as well. And the electrician needs to come to do the sockets and stuff like that. So we've just received the 
uh, all the architraves and the skirter boards. And to do that, they've passed it up and Sue's <laughs> had to stand out <laughs> on the ledge. <laughs> and now, unfortunately, the, uh, the window's locked. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go down to walk fields, uh, just beneath and just get like a sausage roll or something. Um, just while Sue's around there. She's not gonna be happy, but it is really funny. Thanks to the guy from Alties who was actually in on that and made her stand out there for longer than she needed to just so I could shut the window. Very much appreciated. So, next milestone. It's the one by the first line. Happy? Very happy. <laughs> Today is the day of the Christmas shoots and the studio is ready. You can literally still smell a little bit of paint, but the studio is ready. No room. Come this way. <laughs> So we have the little office area. This is where I'm going to sit while Susie's doing most of the shoots. Um, but there is going to be a one button bear sign up there and there's going to be artwork on these walls, but not quite yet. And then, oh, the main studio finally done. Super happy with the way it's turned out. Um, this is now our third studio and this is probably our favorite out of the three. Absolutely gorgeous. And it's super cute and girly. <laughs> and it's actually snowing on the first day of the Christmas shoots. Check it out, it's snowing. That's where Susan stood out on the balcony. You might have seen her if you're in, in Longton, just kind of like stuck out there. Have you forgiven me for that yet? Properly. Depends so. <laughs> what I get for Christmas. But yeah, so just waiting for the first shoots to come in. We've got, uh, what, five today, is it? Five shoots? Um, so we're just waiting on our first one. Got a few brides coming in, uh, some of our previous brides, which is awesome. Super looking forward to seeing them. So thank you for watching the journey of turning the studio around. If you are interested in a newborn shoot, family shoot, indoor or outdoor, then please give us a shout.